Yo, what it is? It's your homie, the last son himself. Thank you for pressing play. And today, I'm going to be talking about finding your spiritual path. People always come up to me asking me, Yo, sons, yo, what, what, what path should I be on? Or uh, am I on the right path to find enlightenment and spirituality? What do you see in me for us going on my path? And the most honest answer I can tell you is that I can't tell you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because if I tell you how to go on your path, how to find your path, and what to do on your path, then it's not your path. It's my path. You know what I'm saying? So the best way I can tell you to find your spiritual path is to look inside of yourself. Look at things inside of you, around you, and of you that you do not like. And cut your course from that. Change some things inside of you that is not good for you. Maybe it's your attitude. Maybe it's your ways. Maybe it's your job. Maybe it's relationship. It's be a numerous amount of things that's not good for you that you need to get out of to find uh, your spiritual path. And another way to find your spiritual path is to go for things that interest you. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's a different religion or to leave religion to study something else, a different way of thinking. Maybe to start traveling. Maybe to start helping people. Whatever it is, if it interests you and it's in your heart and it's burning, go for it. That is your path. Because all nobody can tell your path but you. You know what I'm saying? Now, I can tell you how to start. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to start helping people. I'm saying, okay, get part of this organization here. Start getting involved in community. I can tell you that. But I can tell you what to go to, what to do here, what to keep on doing. Because it takes work to find your path. Because to walk on a path, you you have to walk. I'm not going to hold your hand in doing it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, this is a message for, for people that's watching now, people who has talked to me and and got frustrated with me telling them this, I can't tell you. It's up to you. Do the work. Only you can do the work to go on your spiritual path. You know what I'm saying? And another good way is to find things to study about spirituality. Get some different views. You know what I'm saying? And, like, you can watch my videos and talk to me. I give some of my views and stuff. And maybe some things I'm saying interest you. Or how to go down your spiritual path. Because that's what it is. When you start going inside of wanting to find your path, things going to start just coming at you out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Like, what if you like this? What if you like this? You know what I'm saying? I think this would be good for you. It's the divine trying to give you options. You know what I'm saying? To get to where you want to be in your own self. You know what I'm saying? And take different from ideas from people. Read things. And when you read or talk and start taking all this stuff in, reflect on it. Sit back and just think about everything that you just heard, remembered, or read. You know what I'm saying? Like that's an old saying that you read for 10 minutes, you reflect for an hour. You know what I'm saying? Take your time. It's not going to be an overnight thing to, to be on your spiritual path. It's not. It's, you'd be stupid if you even try to think that. I'm not calling you stupid, but it's, it's not. You know what I'm saying? I'm just telling you from my own experience. And once you reflect it, get inside of you that, whoa, I want to do this. Then you live it. Be about it. You know what I'm saying? Do not just talk about it. Be about it. Go for it. Change your life. You know what I'm saying? Do the positive things. Raise your vibration. Protect your energy. And every damn thing. And I also want to tell you this. Be careful when talking to people. You know what I'm saying? Especially the people that got their spiritual ego about them. You know what I'm saying? They think they know every damn thing. You know what I'm saying? They call themselves, you know, the, the fake gurus and shit. You know what I'm saying? The people that just want your money or just coming after you. Those are people you want to stay away from. You can you can also can tell because they, they got this kind of air about them. Yeah. They just arrogant about it. They they talk about themselves and just 
He's like, oh, I'm so powerful. You should follow me. You know, I can, I can show you your path. No, those not the people you want to talk to. Because they're going to send you down their path, and it's not where you need to be at. See, a person like me, I'm not a guru. <laughs> I don't think of myself as a mentor. I don't, I don't call myself a teacher. I don't call myself none of that. I'm an understander. I help you understand how to get there. You know what I'm saying? And I give you some tips and stuff, but I'm not going to tell you step by step by step by step by step. Because that's up to you. All right? So, this focus on yourself when you want to find your spiritual path onto enlightenment. And remember, it's not overnight. It's going to take a time. You know what I'm saying? Because if it happened overnight, everybody be a, a damn enlightened soul. You know what I'm saying? Even though we all want that, but it's not going to happen because some people don't want to do the work. So you have to do the work to get there. You're going to have to do it. I can't do it for you. She can't do it for you. He can't do it for you. They can't do it for you. You can do it for you. All right, so motivate yourself. So you study, listen, remember, reflect it, and then you live it. Don't talk about it. Be about it, man. All right. So I'm the last son of self. Thank you for watching. And until next time, peace.